a lot of people have started to think very sadly, because this isn't really true, but have started to think about God as someone who gets angry at us and punishes us. And so people have started talking to God like sometimes maybe we talk to our parents when we know that we've done something wrong, right? We say, oh, I'm so sorry, like don't punish me, right? Does that ever happen? Yeah. Do you ever do something that you know you're not supposed to do? I bet you don't. <laughs> do you ever do anything that you know you're not supposed to do? A little bit. A little bit, yeah. So, so if mom or dad catches you, what do you say? Sorry. Sorry. So that's exactly how we are with our mom and dad when we do things that we know we're not supposed to. Yeah. The problem is that when we start to think about God as someone who is just there to punish us or to give us rewards, then we don't really understand that God is everything. Everything, regardless of what you do. When you do what you're supposed to do, God is with you. When you don't do what you're supposed to do, God is with you. Oh, -ho, my lucky day. <laughs> you want to come on this side? Lucky day. So when you do what you're not supposed to do, God is still with you. When you do everything right, God is with you. When you do everything wrong, God is with you. All the time. So I was saying that we should not think about God as just this, this being who's there to just punish us or to give us a reward. Because a reward, maybe we enjoy it for a little bit of time, right? What's your favorite reward? Toffee chocolate. Toffee chocolate, okay. So how long does it take you to eat a toffee chocolate? One, two minutes. One, two minutes. And then what after that? I want to move. Ah, right? <laughs> she could lead my satsang. <laughs> That's exactly what happens. Right? So the happiness that you feel when you eat your toffee lasts for one or two minutes, right? So that's not very long. What we really want is a happiness that keeps lasting, like a toffee in the mouth that never, ever finishes, never goes away. What do you think about that? That would be nice, no? Yeah. But then think about a toffee chocolate that's not only in the mouth, but that also feels like a toffee chocolate in your heart. What do you think about that? What do you think that would feel like? More nice. Yeah, more nice, right? So that's what God gives us, is a feeling of a toffee in our mouth, in our heart, in our whole, everything we are, our bodies, our minds, is just melting into this beautiful toffee chocolate all the time. And it never goes away. So that sounds like something pretty nice, no? But what it means is that we have to stop thinking about just the one minute Wally chocolate. Right? Because if we're only focused on the one minute Wally chocolate, then it's very difficult to focus on the always chocolate. Right? So that's why we focus on God and we go to God so that we feel that beautiful love and connection like the chocolate in our hearts. What do you think about that? The both are same a little bit. In what way? That I love not to get punished and I love the heart in the chocolate. Say that again, you love the? Love the chocolate. Yes, you love the chocolate, absolutely. And what was the other one that you also love? That the heart is in my chocolate. The heart one, yes. But when it's in your heart, it's also in your mouth. Yeah. See, the God chocolate is everywhere. <laughs> you don't have to choose one or the other. It's, it's everywhere. But the difference is, 
it's what lasts all the time. The other ones only last one minute. Yeah. So do you want one that lasts all the time or one that lasts only one minute? That, that lasts all the time. Yeah, <laughs> exactly, exactly. So that's why we connect with God. But yeah. sometimes people become silly and they just say, oh God, please give me the one minute Wally chocolate. Now that's a silly thing to ask for. When you can have the always chocolate, yeah. why would you ask for the one minute Wally? No, I don't know. Right? <laughs> so when people say to God, give me this, give me that, this little thing, that little thing, it's like asking for the one minute chocolate. When really what we say is, I love you, God. Be with me, God. Be in me, be with me. Be as me. So that I can feel you in my mouth like chocolate. And I can feel you in my heart like chocolate. Okay? Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. Oh, good.